Good morning, everyone. This is Miss Jackie and my son Brody. And we're going to do a science experiment today that you guys can try at home. Um, hopefully, it'll be fun and you'll learn something new. So, we're going to learn today about surface tension. And I'll show you here our materials, everything you should just have at home, hopefully. We have just some dish soap, a little bit of pepper. Uh, toothpicks, or I used just some little sticks because I don't have toothpicks. <laughs> and it says food coloring. I couldn't find that either, so I just got some paint and watered it down. Hopefully that works. And then we have a bowl here with just plain water and a bowl here with just plain milk. Um, so the first experiment says fill half of a bowl with water and then sprinkle a thin layer of pepper on the surface. So the bowl of water, a thin layer of pepper. A little more. Okay. Take your stick, one stick, dip it in dish soap. I put a little on my table here because I don't want to stick my stick in my dish soap. So the tip in the soap. Now, touch the middle of the water with the toothpick or stick tip. Woo, what happened to the pepper? What happened? Oh, tell me. The pepper just, it was in the middle and then with the dish soap, it reacted and just fell apart. So did it all the same way. <laughs> it all spread apart. So, you can get a little more soap. And just play around with it. See what happens. Does dish soap attract pepper in water or repel? It's a big word. Repel means go away. Does it, is it attracted or does it go away? Interesting. Now the second part is the bowl of milk. It says to put a few drops of food coloring. Well, like I said, we don't have food coloring. So put a few drops of this watered down paint, just a little bit, in the milk carefully. Okay, do the other one. Hopefully this will work. This is an experiment. So sometimes they work, sometimes they don't. Awesome. Now dip, dip your stick into the dish soap. Just the tip. And then gently put it in the bowl of milk with paint. Swirl it around a little. See what happens. Well, don't stir it, but just kind of see if you can get the colors to move around. What happens when it is touched? the soapy end of the stick. So what happened? Um, and the colors, they just decided to mix and swirl all around. This is definitely one of the most cool experiments I've ever seen. They also spread out. So yeah, it did work with watered down paint. It's a little funky, but it works. So I put Purple and green, I layer purple, green, purple, green. And then when I put my toothpick in, the color spreads out. Check that out. Maybe we can do layers, like a pattern, purple, green, purple, green. You could use more than two colors too. Yeah. If you wanna get creative. Ooh, check it out. It's pretty cool, fun to play with. Well, thanks for joining us, and I hope that you have fun doing some science experiments of your own with your family and whoever you live with. Have a great day.